What's this? Oh, that looked really important, but I can't actually, I can't pull it out. That's what I keep telling myself, Xerxes. I keep telling myself that every single setback is, uh, is putting me onto the right path. You're not all decent people. That's all, keys. Oh, it's just light. <laughs> That's an enemy. Oh my god. The bush is, is trying to kill me. Oh, get out. That's wild. It's strong as well. How can a bush be so strong? It's got like sword hands. Oh, it's not that strong actually. It's not that strong. I got a purple moss clump. It's actually not that strong at all. I just didn't. I only got it with the tip. I only got it with the tip, not the whole thing, not the whole rod. I know, I love this sword. This sword is just BDE. We're in Dark Root Garden. Dark Root Garden. We're in a brand new area with me BDE sword and I'm loving it. I wonder if I can parry... Well, I don't even need to parry them. It's a one, one hit kill. It takes five hits to kill them. Oh my god, I was so lucky to get this drop, wasn't I? And the funny thing is, I didn't even know it was a special drop being a first playthrough. I, uh, I just assumed it was a regular drop for killing that enemy. Don't forget to get good. Good advice. Thank you very much, Gambit. Appreciate that. Don't forget to get good. Parting advice. God damn it, there's two of them. Wow. This is fine. Oh, at least he can't heal. He won't have a little healing potion up his sleeve. He hasn't got any pockets for a start. Excuse me, um, I will have you know, I've been very, I think I've been very proficient at Dark Souls. Dark Souls is not an easy game. And I feel like I've been quite proficient for a first playthrough. It could have gone a lot worse, I feel. What's this? What do we have here? It's a glowing door. Locked by some contraption. Oh, okay. Well, let's find the contraption to unlock it then. So what's been going on, Simmy? What's all the goss? What's been happening in your world lately? I feel like it's been a minute. We'll go this way. We need to remember that door. We don't know what will uh, what will unlock it yet. Oh no! Oh, hang on. I wonder if this is fog, as in new area, or fog, as in about to ah! about to take on enemy. I wonder which way it's it's going to go. We'll find out. Oh, you ruined my thrust. Oh, I was just about to thrust. How very dare. Never get in the way of a thrust. Never. Oh my god, I'm dead now, you pricks. They're a little bit, they're a bit wily when there's three of them all at once. Bloody hell, where's that going to put me? That's okay, that's going to put me at the bonfire. Um, when there's three, you need to be, you need to really bring your A game. You can't bring your B game. Last few weeks been Monday and Tuesday in the office. How are you getting on with that? The adjustment to hybrid working. I don't feel like it would be too bad if, if you've still got a good balance. If you're still going into the office. If you're still working from home a few days. Like, I think it's, it's probably a good balance. Nobody in chat made a joke about thrusting at bushes. Oh, everyone's just worn out. That's why. Everyone's worn out, Gambit. Like, if we talk about thrusting at bushes, like, one more time, like... I just don't think we can handle it anymore. It's just it's part of the course at this point. I do always bring my A game. I don't know what happened, to be honest. I think I just got distracted. I think I'm just too excited. Your work besties back from maternity. Oh, it makes a huge difference, doesn't it? When, like, your favourite people are at work, it makes all the difference. The people you work with are so important. Oh, a blood red moss clump. That's a different. Uh, that's a different kind of clump. I got a purple clump before. Now I have a red one. I can see if this is the area that you were referring to, Wiley. Um, I can see how this would become confusing. Not only is it quite dark, but I think there's going to be a lot of little nooks that you you notice and you go down them and then get sort of a bit distracted about where you've been. I could see that happening. It's all going to look the same, isn't it? You know? They're all dropping a lot of stuff, though. Oh, this isn't the area. <laughs> I'll be quiet now. I was getting really in-depth with it as well. I was like, yeah, I can see it, Wiley. I can see it. Makes sense. Yeah. It's not even this area. Brilliant. Alright, what we're going to do this time is it was a general confusion. Yeah, okay. 
I might get generally confused. I prefer purple too, to be honest. If I had to choose. Uh, we're gonna, we're just gonna make sure that we can handle all three at once. I mean, I don't have to go in there, to be honest. I've got the drop now. I've got the, uh, the loot. Oh, they're onto me. Thrust! Oh, you can't thrust them. You can't. The attack is too slow with these. You can't thrust. Now we know. It's fine. Just get to Orkies otherwise. For fuck's sakes. Okay, I got two. Have a little healer, Rooney. I've only got five flasks now because I haven't done a. Uh, I haven't rested at the uh, at the major bonfire that gives you ten flasks. I haven't done that. You can't thrust either. Well, at least it's not just me, Dark. At least it's not just me. You can you can relate. So that's good. Okay, that's done. We've got the loot. We're going to see what's behind the door. I'm a little bit terrified, to be honest. It's a really big door. I don't think we've come across a fog door of this size at this point. Oh, it's okay. It's just an area door. It's not a, it's not a boss door, which I'm quite happy about, actually. This pleases me. You haven't thrusted in ages. Do you forget, is it like riding a bike, though? Like, once you get going, is it like riding a bike? Oh. Ah! Yeah! I knew that was going to do something, but I had to look, though. Oh, wait. Hang on. Settle down. God damn it. Everything wants to kill me in here. This, everything's so aggressive. Now, if I kill... Can you kill these? Is that actually an enemy or is it just a plant? It's just a plant. So you need to get in and out real quick if you're going to take something from where they are. So I picked up a, um, like riding rusty bike, a rusty bike. Mace is inventing an auto thruster, takes the hard work out of thrusting. I would say that, um, that was probably supposed to be a secret. Um, but now you've gone and told everybody. A partisan. Eh, that's not that exciting. If it can kill me, I can kill it. It is, it's very similar to Dark Souls. It is. So do these drop anything though? These tree snakes, are they worth killing? Or am I better off, like, do you get a decent amount of souls for them? Do they ever... That sometimes? Because they poison you, which I'm not a big fan of. I'm not a big fan of the poison... Um, it's got two heads! Wowee. Okay. It's the surprise factor, yeah. Well, I was surprised. Can confirm, was surprised. Okay. I would like to find a bonfire soon, plus. I would really love a bonfire. I feel like there should be one soon. That seems fair to me. You can't, you can't aim at them. You just have to go. You just have to slash them. You get 60 souls. 60 souls for a poison tree snake. It's kind of, eh, it's not that exciting. Not that thrilling. What's that that's chasing me? Oh, oh, did you see that? What the hell was that? Oh, shit. Now, oh my god! There's things everywhere! Oh, brilliant. This is fine. Everything's massive! Oh, I'm fucked here. Oh. How did this happen? How did this happen? What's he doing? This is wild. I'm, I don't even know what to focus on first. Okay, calm down. You're fine. Not close enough. Not close enough. Okay, new plan. We don't go running through the forest willy-nilly. That's not a good start to the to the well, it's not a good start to the afternoon. Illusory wall ahead. Uh now was that this one that I read? This one. Well, I assumed they were talking about this. Which I can't open. Uh so, do I take that to mean that something will just reveal itself if I run into it? Roll into or hit walls. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. Oh, I had no idea. Oh my god! How are you supposed to know that? Like, dead set though, if I didn't read the message, if I was just playing this and I didn't read the message, how would I have known that that was a special wall? Do they always kind of look like that? Do they have a certain look to them? Like with like a pile of bricks out the front or something. You're waiting for your mum to let you... Oh no. Unbelievable. How annoying. 
they just look a bit off, so you'll kind of see it, and you think that sort of looks like it could be something. Yeah, okay. All right. Well, that's cool. I am very pleased to have this. Very, very pleased to have this. By being creative, that's not being creative, Jarek. If you're playing something for the first time, I don't just randomly try and run into walls. I don't. Thank goodness I'm streaming. A little bit of entertainment for you while you wait. Listen on. I did big brain with the frog one. The case is closed. Case is closed. Just roll into every wall. How tedious though. I'm not, I'm not a wall roller, you know? Don't care for wall rolling. Have I just turned around? No, no, we're fine. Was something chasing me? I thought it was. Oh, of course, they've respawned, haven't they? Because I've just used the bonfire. God damn it. Sorry about that. That makes perfect sense. They don't let you go, do they, those ones? They're very excitable. They love a, uh, love a challenge. Okay, so the mistake we made last time. You do not go dashing through the woods because that there's enemies that come out of nowhere. Like, literally. You need to take it very, very slowly. And I also don't know what's involved with these uh, big knights either. I'm a little bit frightened about those. Maybe we'll try and take one on and see and see how difficult they are as our first enemy. Okay, it's big. What does it do? It's got quite an attack on it. So it goes down and then it does like a little side swipe. Down and a side swipe and something else that I don't, I don't like the look of. What was that? I don't know what that was, but when it does it, is that a healing mo It's like if you hurt it a little bit, it tries to heal itself, but if you go for it while it's doing it, it's actually really vulnerable. That's what seems to happen there. Interesting. Oh, hello, Stefan. Always very concerned about my hydration, I feel. I think this could be very triggering for Greenie, to be honest. I hope Greenie's not watching. Don't hold it against me, Greenie, if you're lurking. I do like nature, really, but nature's trying to hurt me. That's the problem here. Oh, it's all happening, Stefan. It's all happening. I'm in a very scary forest. I'm trying not to die. All of that. Okay, okay. Now they're all coming out at the same time. Don't really like that, but okay. That's fine. Let's try and get rid of these first. Before the night gets all up in it. Could do without everyone being at the party at the same time. Go. Get out of it. Go, 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 go. Okay, so I got a hit in. Now he's healing. Take him out. Oh, well, I think it's healing. I don't really know what that is, to be honest, but it's a good time to kill them. Lovely. Okay, we're learning. This is fine. This is fine. Oh, I'm safe because Greenie's streaming. Good. Lucky. Lucky, lucky. Now, we're going to slowly make our way forwards. There's another one here. It would get very irritating having these popping up every single time you go through this area, though. I hope there's nothing too annoying behind that wall that I'm heading towards. Because I don't want to have to do this every time. You'd want to be able to run past it all, wouldn't you? Otherwise, it's a pain. It's a lot. Oh, okay. Getting a bit nifty, are we? I see how it is. So that knight should have just... Uh, that knight should have sliced straight through that. My immersion... Okay. He's not doing the thing. Whatever the thing is, he's not doing it currently. There it is. And there it is. Okay. Um, there's a little drop over here as well. Let's just pick this up. I really want all of these drops from them. The purple moss and the red moss. It's actually really useful. Um, to reduce any effects that might happen to me. Okay, I've got three flasks. I know my health is only half masked here, but... Oh my god! Oh, holy crap! I wonder if that's better than what I've got. Let's just go over where it's safe and have a look at this. I just picked up a full set of armor. Like a full set. That is wild. How does it compare to what I've got? I've got a standard helm plus one at the moment. The elite knight helm is better. It's heavier though. Uh, is it better? It's not. Well, yes, it is. I suppose it is better because it's not. Um, it's not been upgraded. 
So it, yeah, I guess it is better. What does it look like? Oh, I look a little bit fancy. I do look a bit fancy with it though. I think it's worth it. And what about my, uh, what about the rest of my armor? My hard leather armor. Uh, that's definitely an upgrade if we go for the elite. I, it's making me a lot heavier though. I'm not entirely sure how that's going to go. But geez, I do look a bit fancy though. It could be worth it. Um, and let's just go for the whole lot. I've got some gauntlets here that I can upgrade as well. And the the, uh, the boots. The boots are a huge upgrade. Holy crap, look at that. 6.9 weight as well. Look at me go. This is big. That is a really big armor upgrade. I'm actually a little bit worried about it, to be honest. Why is it upgrading me with that much armor? Oh, now I'm, all, I'm heavy now. Look, I'm doing the chunky roll. Oh, I'm a chunky roller now. That's the only trouble, though. I don't know how I'm going to go with this chunky roll when I'm in battle. Oh, I don't know how that's going to go. I feel very slow. I wonder if I'm better off... Um, it's still bad, even if I'm using my... Even if I put my thing away. No. All right. Well, maybe I'll... Um, maybe I will mix and match then. I don't really want to be to be all slow like that. Uh, now, what was the biggest upgrade? Everything's heavier. So maybe I'll keep my... I like how my new helmet looks, though. Definitely. Did I clean inside? I didn't even think of it, Cat Man. Thank you very much for ruining this for me forever. That's a big upgrade, going for that, uh, for that body armor. But it's very heavy. The gauntlets are negligible. The leggings are 6.9 compared with 3.5. It's the, it's the big one that's making the difference. That's the trouble. It's this that's making the big difference. So I might just swap it for now. I assume that as I upgrade myself, if I upgrade my strength, it's going to be easier for me to wear heavier armor without having the... I'm still rolling like an elephant. It's made no difference. The Hollow Warrior waistcoat is very light. Uh, all right, and that's uh, the same as my previous pantaloon. Oh, yeah, okay, they are light, aren't they? All right, well, let's just go for one of those then. Let's see if that makes a difference. I'm really chonky now. Oh, look at my legs! <laughs> wow, look at my legs! I'm so exposed now! Oh my god, I've got hot pants on. I don't look very menacing now, though. I look like someone woke me up in the middle of the night and I've gone racing out to see what's going on. But I can roll, though. I can roll. I look like someone's woken me up in the night and I haven't had time to put pants on. God damn it. All my mystique is ruined. I know, look at him. Knobbly knees to me. <laughs> okay. Now... I'm hoping there's nothing too nasty over here because uh, I remembered you saying the knobbly knees. I don't want to have to do all of that again. That would that would not please me in the slightest. Okay. He does a sweep. Get in there. Oh, he does another sweep. Well, that's no good. That's really not good. Okay, now he's doing that. But can I get there in time? Probably not. Okay, no time. It's fine. Oh, crap. He's done something to me. That's what that is. I don't know what that is, but um, I'm all slowed. You fuckboy. If you're, if you're not inside the radius of whatever that is, you get something put on you and you feel like you can't move. It's like, it's like you're being slowed. Being slowed or it's like you're over encumbered all of a sudden. That's what it feels like. I hate my legs. I really don't like my legs. Can you knock these down? You can't do anything until they get up. How very dare. I should be able to hit him before he gets up. He took so long. Okay, get in there now. That's when you need to strike. Okay, so that was affecting me. I can see that now. That was actually affecting me. Um, but it didn't matter because I was stood up close to it, killing it. Right. 
So, whatever that is. If you're about to kill it, it's fine. If you're not, it's not fine. Now let's go get my souls before I wake too many things up. I was talking about in the game. Although, I'm not really a leg person. You know how people are, you know how people like different parts of bodies? Legs don't thrill me though, generally speaking. Legs don't thrill me. But I really don't like my in-game legs. I've got 5,000 souls. I could level up. I could level up soon. I reckon that would be enough to get it done. Okay. Here they go. They're all coming out now. They're all coming out. Alright. Depends whose size they are, to be honest. Oh! Get out of it! Looking tits, okay. isn't it? You're fine. Go now. Go now. Before you get all encumbered. Yeah, that's the way. Hello, Elf. Welcome in. How you doing? What's happening? We know how you feel about Bob's arm. Very vocal about Bob's his arm. Okay, I've got so many souls. Oh, okay. Don't dick me around. I'm not interested in you. I've got much bigger fish to fry here. Okay. Lovely. No, 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 no. Okay, lovely. That's fine. We're fine. The effect has worn off because he died. That's all, geez. That's a very long reach. It's got a very long reach on it. That's not natural, is it? At all. You're like, this is Bob's. Hello, Finn Sifty. You did. Who gift subbed you? Um, I think it was Anonymous, a.k.a. I'm pretty sure it was Jarek last night. I'm pretty sure that's where the gift sub came from. How you doing, Finn Sifty? Um, okay. Now, was that the last one of the nights? Let's just check. Oh, it was Goldie. That's right, it was Goldie. I couldn't remember because there was a whole ton of um, anonymous ones last night as well. It was Goldie, in it. Scared your neighbour because you're sitting on the floor near the stairs. What are now you they're awake. Doing here? <laughs> Blame me, Jack, for everything. I do. I do. Well, to be fair, that's because it's usually Jarek's fault. Go. Bail. Bail. I said bail. Okay, he's going to do the thing. Get in there now. Go now. Get it done. That's the way. Now have a little healer, Rooney. I've got all of my flasks here as well. Um, What are you doing here? <laughs> I didn't actually record that. As surprising as that may be to you. Uh, now, good. That's done. I've got a lot of souls. I'm getting a little nervous. When I build up a lot of souls, I get nervous. Okay, now we have... This is the one that bested me last time because I was not expecting it to be there. Not this time. Not today, mate. Not today. Hopefully. Is he going to do the thing? Nope, not yet. Now? Yep, go now. That's the way. Your strength is your weakness, sir. Your strength is your weakness. Now we're going to do another heal. Um, I don't know how much I get out of those flasks, to be honest. I don't know if I'm getting more out of them now. I was getting like half a bar of health originally, but then I went and upgraded them, so I feel like maybe now I'm getting like three quarters. Um, okay, this is all very new. I don't know what is up here, and I'm a little bit frightened and afraid. I'm practically naked and afraid. Look at me legs. Look, I've got upskirt as well. Look at them. You can actually see me ass cheeks. Look. They're all shriveled. Put your bits in me jar. Oh, hello, Webster. Welcome in. How the hell are you doing? What's going on? Of course you come in. Of course you came in at the upskirt. Look, you can see me shriveled. You can see me shriveled cheeks. I felt much more regal when I had pants on, to be honest. Have you been, Webster? What's been going on? Oh, no, it's a fog door. It's a fog door. God damn it. I wouldn't call it perving arm. As I said, I don't really care for my legs. I liked my other pants better, but they were making me too heavy. A moonlight butterfly? Oh, God, what? What's that? Oh! <laughs> oh, I don't like this. What does it do? I'm on a very narrow bridge. 
Oh, this could be bad. What do you do when it's when it's floating off like this? Oh, I'm fucked. There's no way. What the hell do you do? Okay, we can't just stand here getting hit. Let's look around. What else is here? There's got to be something. There's got to be a reason. Or do you just run by? Do you just run past and don't even worry about it right now? Maybe that's the strategy. Go. Have a heal. Have a heal. I'm going very well, Webster. It's been um, a busy time. A busy, weird time. But can't complain. And I'm bloody stuck in here as well. Um, I don't think my crossbow would be strong enough for this. What the fuck? I can't actually get to it. Wild. Does it come close enough so that you can eventually hit it? It does, doesn't it? It does! It's doing something! What's going on? Why is it just sitting there? Is this normal? Uh-oh, something's happening. Something's happening! Oh, it was a big explosion. Okay, I've got this now. I have full confidence in myself now does a big explosion and then it does this thing which is terrifying but we can leap through it oh that was dangerous heal that's my last healing flask as well oh okay let's go come on come up close for a little hug it's got this lovely peaceful music but it's a freaking nightmare this thing come on come in for a little hug you know you want to. Let's go. It's got to get tired eventually, doesn't it? Come here. It's not getting tired. It's really not getting tired. When does it run out of moonlight energy? Come here. actually only had like 25% of it left. I had 25% of its health left. So when it comes down, you can get a lot of hits in. Maybe I could have finished it off at that point, you know. I think I probably could have if I kind of realized what was going on. I can also avoid getting so damaged early on now that I know how to evade those magical attacks as well. Um, that's the first time we've seen that, so that, that was a bit of a time. But I reckon I'm going to get it this time. It's going to be fine, I reckon. Won't be a problem, most likely. Oh, Jarek! How very dare you do that? It's very dark in here. It's a bloody outrage is what that is. Unbelievable. The audacity. Was I on a swear timer? <laughs> Was I on one already? Luckily, I didn't swear, because that would have been super orkies. Okay. Oh, it would be a nightmare. It'd be a nightmare going for that with, um... Oh, it's the aviators as well. Of all of the glasses I could have got, it's one of the darkest pairs in there. Unbelievable, that is. I could probably sprint past all of these, though. I've got the armor. I could probably sprint past, I reckon. They're all quite slow. So if I get inside and then just race up the stairs... Um, I reckon I'm probably okay then. It'd be very annoying if this doesn't work out for me though, because that's a lot of souls that I've dropped. But what are you going to do? Like, it takes a long time to kill all of these enemies. I don't want to keep doing that over and over again. I don't need to now. It's been done. I've proven myself. Got the armor. Bought the t-shirt. Done. Okay, so I'm just going to go straight in. Perfect. Get the souls. Fine. Yeah, they're very slow, so it's really not a problem, is it? Ah, it sounds like my beautiful singing voice, doesn't it? Ah, it's just, it's just like, puts you in some kind of trance. Ah, okay. What's going on then? That's what's going on. That's a tough one to evade, actually. Uh, that's a tough attack to evade when it comes out sort of like daggers like that quite tricky. you got to time it absolutely perfectly or you're fooked. Yeah. 
bad. Heal up, heal, 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 do it now. God damn it. Okay. Come down. This is such a frustrating boss, you can't get at it. Come on. Thank goodness I got my roll sorted out. This would have been great while I was rolling around like an elephant, wouldn't it? It would have been bloody lovely. So now we're on the other side, but I haven't had a... Oh, here we go. Get it done. Get it done. Again. Now, I don't know how many times it will do this. Oh, come on. i got to bail. we got to bail now. Before the explosion. Okay, get in there. Okay, that's it. That's all I've got. I reckon a couple more hits and we've got this. A couple more hits. I think you just have to withstand. I think that's all you can do. You withstand the attacks until you get a minute to um, for it to come down and attack it. I hate that attack. That one is tough. I don't like that. That is the worst one of all. Fuck! Oh, for fuck's sakes! I know I swore. Uh-oh. How long were the glasses on for? Okay, now we're about to do this again. Make our way through. I know, very mysterious indeed. Thank you for the lurk, Simi. I'm actually loving it, to be honest. This is my very first time playing a Dark Souls game. And I'm really enjoying it. Even though I swear a lot. Well, not even that much, really. Uh, it's very rewarding and I have enjoyed the journey. I've done relatively well. I feel as well, like it hasn't been a complete disaster zone. Which is nice. Okay, you cannot afford to get hit by those ones. Those are the worst of all. Bad. This is a nightmare, this thing. It's an actual nightmare. It doesn't look like anything. Like when you first come to it, it's like, oh, it's a butterfly, you know, whatever. Bloody nightmare. I tried a slightly different strategy there of uh, using, the, uh, using the shield, but the shield's actually quite ineffective against these magical attacks. So I seem to be doing better by evading them as best as I can. Seems to be the way to go. So I've used more health than I would have liked. Because I've been trying to use the shields. I don't think it was a good move. Oh, come on. Come down. Let's do a big thrust. Get thrusted. That's going to do more damage, surely. Although it used more stamina, so it might take longer. Go! Get out of the way! Ah! Okay. Now we're going to have a heal. Oh, this thing's a nightmare. Okay. Oh, no, not the beam! I wasn't anticipating the beam. I rolled right into it. I rolled right into the beam. You don't know what it's going to be. You just see this green glow. And you don't know what kind of attack it's going to be. Until it comes out. Again, we're fine. We just need to stay alive so that it comes down again and we can finish it off. A few slashes and we should be fine. Stay positive. Got hit twice for that one. Brilliant. Love that for me. Yeah, keep doing that one. Love that one. That's my favourite, that one. Love that. Just go down. I've survived long enough. I've done a bang up job here. Oh God, I'm gonna die. I've got like the tiniest bit of health left. Just come down, come down. Now, now, now. Keep slashing, slash forever. Oh, do you see how much health I've got left? It's like that. It's a bee's dick of health that I've got left, and I've done it. I've done it, even with the aviators on. Let's go. I got a soul of the moonlight butterfly, which sounds very, very significant. 
I don't know what to use it for yet. <sighs> it's, it's a pretty fight, but it's a pain in the ass. A butterfly's dick, if you like. If you like. Okay. Well, just think about it, Vespid. I mean, what, how big is a bee? So how big is a bee, and then what possible size could, it, could its dick be in relation to its body? Like, it's going to be very small. Very, very small. Like, it's just... It just makes sense. I cannot believe I've got that much health left. Now, what the hell do I do with this thing that I just got? What do I do with, um... Acquire many souls or create a unique weapon? Oh, my God. So I can basically... When I beat it, you'll tell me an easy way. It won't make me upset, Jarek. It won't. It won't. Because I just decided to use my strong gamer sense. A can of insect killer. Oh, you're funny. You never never switch off, Jarek, do you? Not for a second. Um, now, have I got the right way here? I have, haven't I? Oh, my goodness. I've got 18,000 souls. Oh, don't give me that many souls. Have I gone the right way or have I turned myself around? I'm just a bit paranoid now. Go up. I've got 18,000 souls. It's making me very nervous. I don't like being responsible for this many souls. Now, I've, these can come off now. These have been on for heck and ages because of the, um, because of the swear timer. Refresh. Believable. Okay. I don't want anything to kill me up here. I've, I just, I've made it this far. Please let me level up. I already know what I want to level up. I've got two things that I want to work on at the moment. I want to work on my vitality and I want to work on my endurance. So I'm already planning it. What's this? What's this up here? It's not that you don't have confidence, but I have probably turned myself around. Well, it turns out that I didn't. I didn't. It's a bit sad, but it's safe. Then use a homewood bone so I don't get mobbed. Oh, I haven't used one of those yet. That'd be a good chance to, to try one. We have a watchtower basement key. And some divine ember. Which I can use to upgrade my weapons with uh, with old hunky Andre, can't I? And they've given me a homewood bone. So I can use that. So, what's actually happened here? That's not Andre, is it? Why does he look just like him? What's going on? What happened to this one? But, what ha but why does he look just like the other one? What happened to him? Blacksmith? Question mark? He died protecting the Divine Ember. Oh my god. That is a bit sad. Oh heck. Well, hopefully it shan't be in vain. It is lucky you didn't have points riding on that. Boy, would your face have been red. Okay, I have got a bone and I'm going to use it. I have a bone. I haven't used one yet, so this is a good time to, to do that. I've got a few of them, actually. Um, I have two of them. So return to the last bonfire I rested at. Yes, please. That's very, very useful, isn't it? Because then we can just get past all of, the, all of the rabble. That comes as no surprise, Dr. Wiley. What an F whammon. So now we're here. We're going to do a level up. Um, I'm going to... Increase my vitality and also my endurance. Um, I'm not going to roll off the edge. I can tell you that's what I'm not going to do. Uh, I've got 8,000 souls left and I've got 5,000 to go up again. But I'd kind of like to keep some. Although maybe I'm, maybe I'm getting ahead of myself. Maybe I shouldn't even worry about trying to upgrade and get any fancy weapons right now because the weapon that I've got is actually quite good and I've just upgraded it a little bit. So I will spend some more. I will put it on my vitality. There we go. That's as far as I can level for now. That puts me on level 30. I've fairly um, got a fairly good um, rounding of skills at this point. So now that I've done that, uh, going through the forest area, I believe that was the only point of that area, was to get to that staircase, defeat the butterfly, get to the top. That should be me done with this now. Except, what is this all about? I still don't know how to open this door, though. And I can't roll through it. I can't roll through it. So... Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure there wasn't anything there because I did look at the side because I, I love it 
The only thing that stops me drinking more of it is the caffeine content. I'd be bouncing off the walls, you F boy! You nearly knocked me off the edge, how very dare! Can you imagine? Can you imagine? I've got a large soul there, so I can eat that and get some get some extra souls in me um in me pocket. You have an automated coffee machine from Bean, so you've got one of the ones where you you basically press a button and it does the whole thing for you, sort of thing. I know I don't want to dox myself based on my coffee machine. It's a very good point. Very good point. Getting all up and close and all with me coffee machine. I did think about getting one like that, but I actually quite enjoy making my own coffee. Like, I enjoy having a more manual machine. And I was a bit put off it because my parents had one of those super fancy ones and they had nothing but trouble with it. And then they replaced it with another one and had nothing but trouble with that one. So it kind of, I thought, you know what? I just want everything where I can see it. That's what I thought. All me bits and bobs where I can see it for my next coffee machine. And it's nice and easy to descale, all that kind of stuff. That's what I wanted. Now, there was another way there. There was another pathway that I don't know if I looked at last time. So let me check that out before we leave. Just around the corner. There's something here. Up here. What's, what's this? What's the point of it? Is it just to take in the um, ambience of the night? No, there's a little pathway here. I found something. It's something. Where does it go? Nobody knows. Not yet. Dark Root Basin. Oh, okay. We're in another area of the Dark Root place. All right. Be on guard. It's a very wily place. What the hell is that? What's that? Oh, is that one of those things that you get, like, rewards for if you kill it? Where's it gone? Oh, it's gone! Oh, it's gone! Where'd it go? Oh, come on! What a tease! What a tease! There was no time. Wow, we're going really far down here. I nearly walked right... There's something up there. I nearly walked right past all of this to go back up. I didn't know it was here. I just saw something over here. There's a bit of loot on a body. How do I get to that? Can I just roll down? What is that? Oh, it's armor. Mm, it's probably not better than what I've got, but I I assume that at some point I'm going to be able to sell stuff. I haven't found someone that I can sell to yet. I found someone that I can buy from, but I couldn't sell. So there's two possible ways here. Somebody's died here at some point. Why have they died? <laughs> You know, when you see the blood stain, and it's like, why? What's happened here? Did they just jump off the edge, or... Maybe? Maybe they just fell off. This goes re This goes really far down. Now I don't- I don't know what the other area is for, either. Oh, I don't like that being there. I can see why someone's died now. Not great. Not a good time. Is this the same? This is a different kind of enemy. I don't know if we've fought this before. It looks different. God damn it, don't fall off. Don't try and parry either. I don't know what I was thinking there. I don't know why I tried to parry it. Just don't. Don't do it. You're fine. Come on. Get it together. Don't fall off the edge! God damn it, I'm so close to getting it as well. Breathe. Breathe! Okay. Woo -hoo -hoo! We live to see another day. A blue titanite chunk. Now, I've been told that a titanite chunk is quite exciting. Well, it's quite good. You got a Keurig regular drip, espresso cappuccino machine, and the flask drip. Oh, I don't really know the difference between, between that. I do have a, um, I do just have like a percolator style coffee machine as well, which I do still like. I do like that, but I don't like having that kind of coffee all the time. That's more situational for me. It's very strong coffee, which isn't always a bad thing. There's so many ways to go. This is so overwhelming. 
All right, what's this? A grass crest shield. Let's have a little look at that. How does that compare to what I'm what I'm using? I've got a heater shield with 60. The grass crest is um where the hell's that gone? 62 weighs 3. Oh, it's got some um, it's got magic resistance. Is that but the, it, Why is it red though? Oh, oh, it's uh, slightly speeds stamina recovery. Oh, okay. So even though this is comparable in every other way, it's better for me because it's actually helping my stamina regenerate at the same time. But did that say though, you know how it's got on the side, it's got red physical, blue magic. So that is what that means. So it's actually, it's a bit lower than what I'm using. So this is showing a comparison to what I've currently got equipped. So it's red because it's 95 instead of 100 compared to what I've got. But then it's got magic damage reduction, which I didn't have before. All right, well, let me try it. Let's see how we go with it. Um, let's just see how it feels. Uh, so many swords. Look at this. Okay. It does look nice. It does look a bit fancy. I'm looking I'm a rather fancy woman now. Oh, so I've got those little arrows under my stamina, indicating that I've got a piece of equipment that is actually affecting my stats. Oh, there's a bonfire in here! Can you imagine if I didn't look? Oh, bless your socks. Bless your socks. I have a bonfire. Oh, thank God. Okay. Um, I can't quite level up yet. You got inside and shoved pizza in your gob. That's what we like to hear. What kind of pizza are you having? I had a very healthy dinner. I made a uh, plant-based chicken with potato salad and garlicky veggies. It was very good. It was very nice. Now, there is another way that I didn't look at, I might add. When I was up the top... Uh, there's another way that I didn't look at, but I don't know where this goes. So I guess I'll just look in here first. Maybe this takes you to the top of the hill or something. I've got no idea. Aren't they all plant-based? Ah, ah, ah. I tell you what, if you are going to have... No, this goes down. If you are going to have a plant-based meat, chicken is one of the best types. Like, honestly, most of the time, you just can't tell the difference with chicken. It's quite amazing. A pepperoni pizza. Good old-fashioned pepperoni pizza. So this goes all the way down. When we want to go back up, I assume we're going to use it again. I don't like it in here. It's dark. I'm frightened. This is frightening. Oh, no. <laughs> what is this? I'm frightened. Oh, this is just a standard enemy down here, is it? There's two of... There's three of the bastards. Brilliant. That's just standard now. That's where we're at at this point. Love that. Valley of Drakes. I don't know if I want to be here yet. No, I'm not going to. I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. If I go back up, then maybe I could just go and look at the top. And then make my way back to... Oh, let's just see how strong they are. We're here. We're here. We'll just deal with one at a time. Oh, God. I'm terrified. They're going to they're gonna breathe fire, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, it's lightning! Oh! <gasps> It's lightning, and it's very, very deadly. Very deadly. Holy crap. Oh, I feel bad. I feel bad. They're kind of cute. You prick. Oh, look at how many there are. Look at how many there are. I, look, I can't see a reality where I'm going to get through there without a lot of grief. That is a lot, but we're going to go back and at least get the souls and maybe have, an have another try. We'll have a try and see. Get the lift to come back. If it feels like it's a little bit too high level for me right now, then I'm going to come back up the elevator and we'll go back the way we came and go back to the original plan that I've been waylaid from. I also don't know if this is, like, a must-do area or if this is, like, you know, an extra bit. I don't know. 
Wowie, look how fancy I look now, though. I'm so impressed. I'm so impressed. Okay, now we know about the lightning effect. Don't get struck by the lightning. Do collect souls. Plus. Watch out for the for the big attack. Bail. Go now. And bail. Okay. Not joking, is it? It's not dicking around, this one. Okay, you need to get out of there. Yesterday. Okay. And again. Again! Oh no 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 I nearly had it! I rolled the wrong way. I rolled the wrong way. Sugar. I at least want to... I want to go back and get the souls. I can defeat that on its own. I just want to defeat one and kind of see what the go is. Um, I don't really want to take on a whole bunch of them right now, though. That's that's a nightmare. That's actually a death sentence. Having, like, three of them in the same place is overkill. There must be something very important in that building that they are guarding. Imagine having three dragons guarding one door against little old me. It's nuts. Okay. You just have to be you just have to be really on your game. If you're on your game, it's fine. If you get struck by the lightning multiple times, you're probably gonna die. The lightning is unbelievably powerful, which I guess makes a lot of sense. Okay. Want to get to me, souls? If you don't mind, that's what I'm interested in. Let's go. That's the way. All right. Now we can worry about the battle. Just wanted those souls first. Bail. Bail. I could have got another hit in. Most definitely. Definitely could have. Wait, I'm waiting for the lightning. <laughs> That's new! I didn't know I could do that! Oh, brilliant. Love that. Now it's bloody bringing out new tricks as well. Now it's really miffed. Okay, I didn't know I could do that. Learning. We're learning. It's very strong. Oh my god. Two, two. No, it's ready. It's reading me like a book at this point. We've got a little thing going on here. Okay. Get closer. Get closer, but not too close. Bail. Bail. Oh, so close. <gasps> You're fine. You're fine. I haven't even had to heal till now. Oh, shit. Okay. Go in now. Do it now. Now. Okay. All right. That's one. <laughs> That's one. Look how many there are. That's ridiculous. It's a dragon scale. I don't know what they are, but it looks very important. It looks very important. And we can also go up the hill here as well. Oh, my God. If that flew all the time, I would have cried. I would have cried. Okay. Now. I'm, I don't know. I don't think I can handle all of that right now. Even if I go in and try and engage one, they're all going to get involved and I'm just not going to be able to do it. I'm not strong enough at this point, I don't think. So I've got one. We know what the go is. I got my souls. I'm going to check this little puff. Wow. Wow. They're putting them on the pathways as well. Could be little legs. Okay. Okay. Oh, and it doesn't want to come out either. It wants me to fight it there. No, I'm not going to fight it there. You can come over here if you want to fight me. I'm not having that. We're not doing that. Come on. Let's go. You're coming over here. We're doing this on, on my terms, mate. Look at it. It's backing away. It's backing away. 
How dare. Oh no, now it's, now it's flying. Where's it going now? <laughs> it died! It died! How did it die? It flew off the edge, but they can fly. Can't they? It flew off the edge and died, and I got a thousand souls. What the hell? Well, I wasn't expecting that. I got a thousand souls for just luring it off. It's a glitch. Well, that's nice. Hey, you take the wins when you can get them. Take the wins when you can. Got some humanity as well. well there you go. Now we know. Now we know. What the hell is that at the end? That looks quite frightening. Is that a giant stone dragon? I don't like how narrow the pathway is. Oh, I forgot that it could fly. That's always very orkies, isn't it? What is this? That's not going to come to life, is it? I don't think that's a now thing, to be honest. Holy crap. Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah, is it dead? Like, dead dead? <laughs> oh, it's got something. Soul of a proud knight. It is actually dead. Oh, look at all of this. <gasps> ah, get it out! Bail! Oh, no! Me fucking souls! How could you do that to me? How could you do that? That bastard. That is the best game bait I have ever had in my life because it's like, okay. Are you trying to make me look stupid in front of the other guests? I don't need any help from me, sir. That's I, right. I went in there expecting it to do something and I'm sort of testing the waters. There's nothing going on. I go around the corner. I pull something up. Nothing. It's actually dead. And then it waits until you get all in the center and it gets you. And I've lost all of my souls there as well. So chances are, what chance have I got of getting those souls back and getting out alive? God damn it. So what did I get? I got some armor though before I was brutally murdered. Um, there was something I didn't get though. There's something I didn't pick up while I was there. I don't know what it was. I didn't get to it. Uh, it wasn't a helmet that I got. What was it? Uh, I did pick it up, right? It was just a shield and a sword, was it? Oh. Um, okay, oh, the Dragon Crest Shield. So let's have a look at this then. Shield of a Nameless Knight, li likely a high-ranked knight of Astora. One of the enchanted blue shields. It reduces fire damage. What about electric damage? That could be very useful, though, at the right time. So we have a shield that reduces fire damage, should I need it, which I'm sure I will. I'm going to keep the shield that I'm using right now for the stamina, but if I come across an area where there's a lot of fiery things that will be good and what what was the other thing that i got uh what did i pick up a stora's straight sword okay so you know it's a it's it's fine unless it's got something special about it it's got a powerful blessing a powerful blessing that I don't know what it is. Well, let's have a little... Let's just look. I'm not going to necessarily use it straight away, but let me just see what the blessing is supposed to be. Oh, okay. So I need to have maybe, like, higher faith. Higher faith to be able to use a blessed weapon, I assume. So, yeah. So we'll just leave that for now. That's okay. That makes sense. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get those souls, to be honest. And if I'm going to go that far, I have to... I kind of feel like maybe I should just leave those souls there. It was like 7,000 of them. But that's becoming less of a number now because the enemies are tougher. I have to kill two dragons to get to it and I don't even know that I'm going to get out. Oh, I mean, I don't know if I can outrun those dragons though. What do I have to lose? I guess nothing. True. My souls are already gone. Well, they're already dropped. Okay. I'm going to run with my little scrawny legs and we'll see if I can get my souls out of there and get out again. Oh my god.
This could be bad. This could be a time. I'm a bit worried. That is an impressive sword that I've got though, isn't it? Look at the size of it. It's a very intimidating sword. Okay. Now, what I could do, I might... Should I unequip my weapons? You can keep running forward in the direction past the dragon. Oh. Maybe I'll unequip these to make myself faster. Does it make... It should make me faster, surely. Um, because I don't... I'm not going to try and fight them. We're just going to go for this and see how it works out. Look at me. I look so desperate. I look so desperate with my scrawny legs. Okay, come on. You're fine. You're fine. You've got the stamina. We're doing a very important uphill jog today. It's fine. Get that stamina back. Oh, that's permanently awake now. It's bloody awake now that I've woken it up. It's permanently awake. Oh, god damn it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Ah! Oh, what the? F what is that? Get the souls. Grab them. Run. Oh my god, I'm doing it! I'm doing it! I'm doing it! I've done it. We're out. Holy crap. Okay, we've, we've done it. We've done it. Oh, the adrenaline. Okay. Look at me go. Alright, now I'm going to get my sword and everything back out again. I don't know. That was like some kind of poisonous thing that it spewed out. Actually, no, I think it made me bleed. I think whatever it was, it was spewing out of its mouth had a bleed effect on it. Which is very problematic as well. God, there's so many ways to go. How do you know where to go? I wasn't even supposed to be here. I was looking at something else earlier. And now look at where I am. A large soul of a nameless soldier. We have a locked door. Well, I'm glad about that because I'm getting overwhelmed now. We'll look in here and see what's happening. I'd love to find a bonfire. Do you think I could be cheeky enough to find a random clifftop bonfire? This feels like it's going to be a boss fight in here. Oh, I'm worried. I don't like it. Why is there so many swords? It's like Game of Thrones in here. Oh, it sticks. I'm worried. Are they spider webs? Are they spider webs on there? The hell are they? They look like mountain trolls. Oh my god, I don't know what they are. Oh, what if I, I don't want to lose my souls in here? Ah, they're not spider webs. Well, that's something. Maybe I can just sneak up and take him from behind. Maybe he'll never know. Go for the thrust. Thrust! Oh, that did stuff all! That did nothing! They are very strong! And they've got bleed on their weapons as well. I don't think I can do this cave right now. I don't think this is a good idea. That was from behind and it did barely anything. I can homeward bone. Maybe I should. Do you think I should homeward bone? I don't think that this is good. I don't think this is a good scenario. It's chasing me a really long way as well. Okay. I wonder if I can use it quick enough before it gets to me. Use me, Bone! Use it! <laughs> Bye! <laughs> no way! I went right up behind it, from behind. It didn't know I was there, and I did a really strong attack, and it did nothing. Nah, okay. I'm fine with that. Now, let's level up. Uh, let's go for... Um, I need some more bones now. I've run out of bones. That's my last one. I'm going to increase... Um, I'm going to increase my, my strength. I like having a strong character, and I think I'm going to enjoy using the kinds of weapons that would need high strength and wearing the kind of armor that needs high strength. I think that's going to be good. So, um, we, we're going to come back to that at another time. I need, I can just tell I need to be a higher level to, to deal with that area for sure. Um, that's a bit much for me. So what we'll do, I ended up here by accident because I came to the bottom of the hill and what I was originally doing, I was trying to just make my way back to the other area and then I got to this grassy bit and I started running down a hill. I've gone many a mile now 
But there was another direction that I could go. Now, I think there's going to be a... There's a knight that spawns on here somewhere. I'm pretty sure. More caffeine. It's too late in the night. I'm this good without caffeine as well. I'm not even caffeinated. I'm still pro gammon. Right. So, now... I went down here, but I noticed this area. There was something glowing on the end. So we're going to take that. It's another large soul. Holy crap, what the hell are these? What are these? What do they do? They look big. How strong are they? Everything wants to kill you in this game, doesn't it? Well, what, what do they do then? Let's see. The up thrust. It's an up thrust. Ooh, it's a freeze. It's a freeze effect. Okay. There's another one getting involved now. I could do without that. I don't need two of them. Okay, they're not overly they're not overly strong as long as you don't get affected by their special attack. My god. I know pro gammon all over the place, aren't I? Oh, that's bad. That's very nasty. That's very strong. We don't want that. No. Bail. Bail now. Go again. Bail again. Go now. Okay. Okay. I think I've got them sussed. I think I know what the best strat is to use for those now. That's fine. That's okay. So over here... Um, let's just investigate. There's another one. And there's like a beach. It's like we've got to a beach or something. What is that in the water? There's like a three-headed serpent in there or something. Look at this. Oh no, it's got like 69 heads on it. Oh, brilliant. Ah! Why is it getting involved now? I'm miles away. You're bloody joking. I'm not even there yet. I'm just looking. Oh, brilliant. This is fine. Now now they're getting involved as well. This is... Uh, you've met Philantra. It's been a time. There's been a lot going on. A lot of stuff. It's a hydra. That's what it is. That makes perfect sense now. Uh-oh. I shouldn't have done that then. That was a very bad time to go in for an attack. Get out of it. Get out of it now. Have a heal. Okay. Again. Go. Go. Okay, that one's done. That's three. Three down. Three down. Okay, so there's one left. Yeah, I had a little, had a little shufty in the Valley of the Drakes, and um, I, I, I got so far in there, and then I decided to leave that for a bit of time because that's a very high level area. I poked an orc up the ass, and that that was frightening, so I left. Um, now, I don't know what's involved. I don't know what the deal is with this boss. I don't know if this is too high level for me. Let's just deal with this thing. Get this out of the way. Uh, and then we might go and have a bit of a look. And before I look at that, I might just go look around the corner as well. Because I'm kind of interested in what's going on over there. Yeah, done the butterfly. Completed it, mate. Butterfly done. Butterfly done. Oh, don't roll onto a rock. Oh, get out of there. Get out of the rock. Get out. Get, 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 get. That's bad. That's bad. We're going to get into a better area here. Don't like that. That's a bit bit nasty. Okay, we're fine. Alright, let's do a little heal. Um, and then we're just going to go... There's an area over here that I just want to have a bit of a look at. It goes uphill, but I don't know where it goes. And I'd rather know before I probably get murdered by the Hydra. No, Urk hasn't been in tonight. I don't know if we'll see Urk, because Urk's on a road trip. So Urk has missed the action. Uh, there's something on here. I should be able to get on this. How do I get on that little nook? Because I'm sure I saw a little bit of loot there. Or maybe I didn't. No, there's got to be a way of getting on that. I reckon I saw something. Hi, Erk. When do you look at VOD? Hi, Erk. Hi. Hi. I haven't even... I haven't even had a budgie smuggler, have I? There hasn't even been a budgie smuggler. What are you thinking about starting, Miss Anon? 
I think you should do whatever whatever you enjoy, especially after locking yourself out of the house today. Now let's look in here. This is probably just a locked door, to be honest. Oh, what? That's what I got the key for. Is there a bonfire? Please. Ah! What the hell is this? How very dare? Oh, it's strong as as well. Are you joking me? Oh, brilliant. That was a one hit death as well. Oh, I can't believe I didn't even. He was hiding behind the door. I didn't even know he was there. Oh my god, okay. Alright, let's see if we can deal with him. I want to go in there and get those souls back at the very least. Um, I can just I can just run past all of those other enemies, I think. It's probably going to be fine. Oh my god! I wasn't even supposed to be down here. This, this is like me getting waylaid severely. I was going in another direction. And now, here we are. I'm just opening up all these new areas. Okay. Now, I, I had been carrying that key. I think I picked that key up relatively recently, so I would like to use it and see what's going on. I feel like that might that might make a nice shortcut for me, I think. I think that's going to be very worthwhile defeating that boss so that I can figure that out. Well, maybe what? why is it his watchtower? If I did make it through, I've made some impressive progress. Thank you, Philantra. I'm quite pleased, actually. I'm quite pleased with the progress that I've made. Um, and everyone, like, no one has, has spoiled it for me either, which has been, everyone's been really good. No one has ruined anything. Like, I've been able to be genuinely surprised by things, which has been good because I've been genuinely surprised by some things tonight. Big time. Okay, so now we cannot, under any circumstances, get hit by that weapon. That is a terrible, terrible weapon. We're going to go get the souls. I don't know how well my shield works. It doesn't work at all. I can't even defend against it. I know my legs. Okay. You don't even get a chance. That's the thing. It's like a one hit. Bloody one hit wonder. Alright. And it hides behind the door? Oh. Alright. What are we going to do? Nah. No. Don't like that. We're going to come in. We're going to get the souls. And we're going to nick off. We're going to nick off up the stairs. We'll deal with him at another time. But for now, I want to see where the stairs go. That's too hard. That's way too hard. Holy crap. Okay. There's a couple of areas I need to come back to now. I need to come back to the Drake Valley area at another time. And possibly this one, depending where it goes. It's really hard. It's really easy to keep starting new games. And I think this is what I was talking about earlier when I was talking about Elden Ring and Dark Souls. So many games are just enormous now. The playthrough time is so long that you start them and they seem like such a task to get them finished. Like you have to pour so many hours in to get them finished. And then a new shiny game comes out and you start that one and you don't finish that. And you never end up finishing any games. And I kind of... I don't like that. I like the satisfaction of seeing a game through from beginning to end. Like I finished Tomb Raider on the weekend and it felt really satisfying just finishing a game, knocking it out from beginning to end without getting distracted with anything. There's probably another one at the top. Okay, we're back in the Berg. Back in the Berg. He won't come up all these stairs, surely. Why would he be asked? Why would you concern yourself going up this many stairs? He'll give up. Okay, so we're back in the Berg. And I can use my key on here. And then we're back here. Alright. Okay. That's very interesting. So this has taken me to another tower here. This staircase goes up the top. Ah, oh, I know where I am. Isn't this where I defeated that first boss? And that, yep. I know exactly where I am. So this is where we defeated that boss, and that doorway was the locked door at the bottom. We came across this door very early, and it was locked. Okay. that That's quite a shortcut, then. That's very cool, isn't it? Everything really just spins back around on itself. It's crazy. It is crazy. 
Yes, I did get very lucky to get this sword. I didn't know how lucky I was until Wiley told me it's a very rare drop. It's a very strong sword. Uh, and that has definitely, definitely made a difference because I was using just a basic long sword before this. And the difference between that and this sword is, uh, is big. So now that we're here, now that I'm here, where's the, where's my nearest bonfire? I, I just need to get myself acquainted with this, this little zone here. I feel like I might like to rest at one of these bonfires now. Now that I've opened up that shortcut. Oh yeah, yeah, so this, right. So this would take me back to the original bonfire. Well, not the original one, but the early bonfire. Uh, 232 hours, oh my god. What game did you say that you were thinking of playing tonight though, Miss Anon? What were you thinking of starting tonight? What would lure you in? I remember this area very well. We've been through this a few times when I was trying to get that Black Knight defeated. That was a time. Wasn't it just? And I can slice through them much easier now. Look at me go. Look at me go. Get wrecked. Okay. So I'm going to regroup. That's what we're going to do. We're going to regroup. I'm going to go to the bonfire. And I'm going to figure out where I'd like to be. Because uh, this was actually where I was going to go. Ultimately, I was making my way back to here. Well, I thought I was anyway. Okay. Kill these ones as well, because they're a pain. Wow, look at that. One, just getting through them in one hit is amazing. So this bonfire is actually Kui. It's a Kui bonfire because it's in the center of so many things now. If I go up the ladder, I can be where all of the tower stuff is. If I go the other way, I can be where the forest part is. So it's actually very central. Who knew? Um, right, so we're just going to regroup for a second. So what I did... When I went through the forest... I got to the forest because I continued on from where the smith is. There's a big boss right there. Well, it's not a boss. It's like a mini boss. I defeated that. And then I went forwards into the forest area. I defeated the butterfly. I did all of that stuff. And then I got a little bit waylaid in that area, looking at the other things, which feel like they're too high level for me. So if I'm not going to go there, I'm not entirely sure where I do go at this point. Uh, let me just check my keys. There's a lot going on, you see. The gargoyles was quite a time. I didn't realize there was going to be two of them until there was two of them, but we made it. So we have a dungeon of undead asylum in the north. We have two asylum keys. We have three asylum keys and we have a residence key for undead Berg residences. But I, I feel like I've opened every door that I've seen so far. We have a basic prison cell key, the basement key that I've already used. All right, well, you know what I'm going to do, everyone? This is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to run through this area, right? This is where we started the game. I'm going to do a bit of a sweep through and see if there's something that maybe I didn't open, a door or a gate or something I haven't seen. Um, I'm not too concerned about the enemies now because I can, I can defeat them pretty easily. So it shouldn't be excessively grindy. I wouldn't have thought. Um, and then I'll just feel sort of satisfied that I've looked at everything because the trouble is you get distracted so quickly and then you don't know where you've been. Okay, so we have a gate that can't open here. It opens from the other side. Of course it does. Of course it does. Okay. Now let's have a little look in here. See what's going on. Now, bearing in mind, I have found some items in here that uh, people may not have realized I found from earlier. So I've already opened the chest. I've already found the merchant that I can trade souls for items. That's done. That's all done. And as part of that, I ended up finding a whole bunch of passageways around. I've been up on rooftop areas. I've been all over the place. I've done that. So I'm looking for more major stuff than that. Okay, 
I did get a key for this. I looked in here, I opened it up, and that opened up a whole area. That's all been done as well. That's fine. We'll kill this uh, F boy on top of the watchtower because he's just a pain in the ass. Uh, we'll go down. I also went back and I've defeated the second Black Knight. That's been done. Completed it, mate. Done. It is so satisfying being able to slice through these irritating enemies because they do faff about. Like, they really hold you up at the beginning of the game. Very faffy. Especially the spear one. Real pain. Very good. So, I'll probably have a little heal. Um, we've been down here. Now, there's a door down here, but I don't think it was a lock. I think it had a barricade on it, and I don't think I can do anything there. So that's blocked off. That's fine. Then we go up the tower. Oh, Fitty's put some picks. Good. I said to Fit, please put picks, plus. Plus put picks on, plus. Fitty's currently in Europe. Having a heckin' good time. We can live vicariously through Fitz's European holiday. So this is the door that I came through before. That's our shortcut to get to the green, terrifying area that feels very high level for me right now. This takes us up to where we defeated the twin gargoyles earlier. Luckily they don't respawn, because who could be bothered? Let's not worry about the two things on top of the tower. I can't be bothered with the crossbows, whatever. Don't look up me skirt, everyone. It's flapping in the breeze. Now, if we come back through here, we'll make our way... Oh, you know what we haven't worked out? The dragon. There's a dragon down here that is guarding the entranceway. Oh, and there's a door here that maybe I can open now. I couldn't open this before. Oh, okay. Yes, we came across this ages ago when we got bloody burned by the dragon. Now I have a key for it. Okay. So what's in the basement? So what's Fit been getting up to? What kind of mischief? I wonder if he took blue fire with him. Surely. You'd think. I wish you could go faster down the ladder. Like whiz down. We need a whiz ability. Alright, what's down here? This is exciting, isn't it? Hello? What's going on? Two different pathways. Oh, in, in London. Oh, you can hold sprint to do that. You can whiz. Brilliant. Love that. Love a good whiz. Okay, well, let's look down first, but let's remember that I need to go up. Oh, this is different. What the fuck? What the hell are these? They look diseased. They look like diseased dogs that would give me a, like a bleed effect or something. That's what it looks like. Oh, there's another one! Oh, it's something else. It looks like a rot a rot effect, maybe? Oh, I don't like those. This is a whole new area. It's a whole new world. Well, let's look upstairs then. Before I get carried away, I just want to see what's up the stairs then. In case it's like a dead end sort of thing. What's this? Where's this go? Oh, it's a locked door. Oh, <laughs> get out! That's the door! Oh, I... I bloody love this game. I love this game so much. That's the bloody door that takes you back the other way. Oh, well. I'm glad I looked. Okay. Okay, that's wild. That's wild. Mine's is blown. That's very cool. So, okay. Now, we're going to go look in this weird little half-dead city. I feel like this might be a bit more my, my speed for my current level. I just feel, you know, with it being in this first area... I know, just stuff like that. It's just like this big... I don't know, it just feels super rewarding. I can't even describe it. Can't describe it. Um, I have a weird little effect on me. What's that? It, has that been there the whole time? Is that from my shield? That green... That green light behind me. I'm assuming that's my shield effect. For the extra stamina regeneration. Uh, let's go back. We'll look back first. Because there's always 69 different ways to go. Somebody. Hello? Somebody. Help me. Unlock the door. Damn. I'm finished. How did this You're finished? What do you mean? What happened? I can use my residence key. Hello? Brilliant. You opened the door for me. There's no Thank furniture, you. just barrels. <laughs> I'm saved. 
I thought I might never escape. I am Griggs of Vinheim, a, a sorcerer. sorcerer. Who I am much obliged for your assistance. Thanks to you, I may now resume my travel. Oh. So can I learn things from them? Let me see. Let me talk again. Oh, hello. Hello. My sorcery. Besides, I have an important task at hand. Oh, okay. So maybe they come into it later. Oh, hello. I'm fine. I will rest a while. He's going to return to Firelink Shrine. I have my source. Besides, I have... Okay. Well, I feel like we're going to see them again. They're going to return to Firelink Shrine. It's going to smash all these barrels. You don't mind, do you? I like a little barrel smash. See what's going on in there. See what's hiding. Oh, there's something. Oh, we got some sorcerer gear. That's very interesting. Um, if you're a magic character, I'm sure this would be very exciting for you. It's not what I'm after for myself at this point. But uh, that's what you get for rolling through barrels. Firelink Shrine is the beginning area. So I'm assuming that now that I've released them, they're just going to spawn at the beginning area whenever I want to go back and... Look at all these F-boys. When I want to go back and deal with them. Oh, they've got flames now. I see. Hmm. I might use my flame shield. I've got a flame shield for this very occasion. My dragon crest shield. That'll sort you out, you little bastards. Okay. I'm not going in there with them all pouncing on me. That'd be a nightmare. Not while they've got those those flame things as well. No. I don't think so. Very good. That's a pain. That is a real pain. I don't like the flame. It's very easy for them to set me on fire with those spindly little arms that they've got. Can you imagine getting all caught up with a whole bunch of them on this little um, balcony? There's a lot of undead, gross dogs, fireboys down here. It's very concerning to me. They're all waving their fire sticks at me. It's not very, it's not very welcoming, I have to say. Of course you would, Jarek. This is not a good place to put sunglasses on. And I had to wear sunglasses for a boss fight earlier. Okay. Now we need the Queen A game as well. Which actually slides on a lot better under this new headset of mine. I got this new headset last week and I'm very impressed. I'm very impressed. It's a, the Logitech G733 and it is just, it is so comfortable. Like I feel like I don't have a headset on. Okay, what was that? Ah, okay, hello. Oh, this is new. We haven't come across one of those. What's that? They look like an assassin. Oh, there's heaps of them. Ah. Uh, what? How very dare! It just jumped and cut my throat! That's ridiculous! I've been assaulted. My ears have been assaulted. My body's been assaulted. Oh, coffee. Coffee's just arrived though, just to take the edge off, which is nice. Okay, so we have to watch out for that. These doors that appear to not open can be opened by these assassin types. And they do it after you've gone past, so you can get swarmed by them without realizing um the light headset is a big deal for me a heavy headset i wear a headset pretty much all day I, I use it almost all day for work i use it for video editing and then i'm using it for the streams so i've got it on a really really long time so the comfort factor is very big for me obviously the sound quality is important too but the the comfort factor is massive and if you're streaming as well I think you want to have a headset that, that has a, like a bit of, has a nice look to it as well. Something that looks nice. So it ticked all of the boxes. Okay, so there's, oh, I reckon that's going to be a boss at the end. I think that's going to be a boss door. Oh my god. And I think it's going to be a boss that's going to try and rot me to death. Because it's all about the rot down here, isn't it? I think that's what it is. It feels like rot. Oh, look, we've got some thief stuff. We've got some black leather armor. And there's a target shield. What's involved with the target shield? What's that all about? That's if you're going for a stealthy character, I suppose. We've found a full set of armor for a sorcerer. This one's like a stealthy, maybe like a ranged one. Let me see. Target shield, 56. 56 and... 
Um, they're less stable. Landing critical hits after parry is easier. Oh, it's a specialized parrying shield. Right. So if I was to look at the comparison between between these, obviously it's going to be less uh, less protection for me. But I already downgraded back to my original hard leather armor because wearing the elite knight armor was making me too heavy. So the black leather armor, is that what I just collected? Because that's quite comparable. I think it is. That's quite comparable. It's lighter. Um, you get a decent level of protection. It's good for sneaking around. I wonder if that might be worthwhile because it's not that different, like in strength. And then the black leather gloves... Yeah, so it's a stealth. It's a stealth outfit. What about the legs? Let's maybe replace the legs a bit. I don't like seeing my legs out all the time like this. Let's go for the... Um, we'll go for the black leather boots. Because that's, a, that's an improvement straight away. So we're going to put some black leather boots on. And then... I've only got one ring still. I've got two shoes now. I should have two boots, which would be nice. I think I'm going to look a bit fancier with this, won't I? Well, let's change. I've got some pants on, and maybe I'll also change my my hard leather armor. I know I'm ready to go. Lock up your daughters. Lock up your sons. We're ready to go. Um, black leather armor. Yeah, I reckon I can. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm going to go for a bit of a hybrid. I'm going to keep some of my other stuff. I'm going to keep my new helm that I found. Um, I might keep the dragon crest shield. I feel like that might be a good move. Oh, look at me. Oh, I'm cutting quite a fine figure now. That looks a lot nicer. My legs look better when they're covered in black leather, I feel. It's a much more sophisticated look, isn't it? I'm feeling more excited here. This is good. Okay. Now, I wonder if it's going to be like a giant... A giant diseased animal or something like that. The good thing is if I die, I can probably run past most of the enemies to get here to do it again. Okay, we're going to have a sip of coffee and we're going to do this thing. We're going to see what this is. I've only got two flasks though. I'm not a massive fan of going in with only two flasks, but anyway. Let's see. Why am I always doing a boss fight with glasses on? Brilliant. Every single time. Why are you like this? Okay. Oh, there's another one. Oh, these dogs are a pain. Oh, God. Okay. Right. Now we know. Now we know. Um, it's a very tight space. It kicks off instantly. We have a nice little shortcut over here, which I can probably just dash through. I reckon I can do that. I can do that. Um, it's just a matter of, like, being prepared. Um, and really, we can't allow those dogs to be getting those hits in because that's just going to... It's going to build up whatever that effect is, which will make it tough. So, let's have to keep an eye out for that. But it feels doable. We'll give that another go. We'll try and get through this area as, as well as we can. Oh, Nutsack got caught in the auto mod. Imagine. Imagine Nutsack getting caught in the auto mod. Every, like, I've got a few things that are just sort of getting stuck in there because I don't have... I don't have um, active mods tonight. So I can't um, keep tabbing out to take things out. Okay! Okay! Now... Oh, wait. Hang on. There's another one here. Another one. Are we good? Are we good? We're good. Okay. Now, we're going to try this again. Very annoying when your sack of nuts gets stuck, I know. The pain of it all. Always pulls me hair out, even with this headset. Okay. We're going to try that again. We're going to see how that goes. Okay, I've got four flasks left, so I'm in better shape for getting into the boss. But the trouble with this boss is... Um, I think everything in there has that same blood loss effect on it. I think next time I level up my character, I'm going to increase my resistance. I think starting to work on the resistance is going to be quite important. 
I don't want that to be an especially weak area for me, especially because I'm very much an all up in it kind of fighter. Like I'm going for that heavy kind of let's get in there and fight. I don't want um, special effects to completely ruin me when I'm in those scenarios. I know, the sword is so powerful. It's the most satisfying sword to use, honestly. Okay, so what we're going to do, I think we have to focus on the two, the rabid dogs first. We can't let them come through um, and bite me. Just avoid the boss as much as we can. It starts attacking you while you're still in the fog, which is very rude. I can't even see. This is a nightmare in here. You can't even see. There's trees. How do you know where everything is? Nah, I don't like that. This is an absolutely ridiculous area to have a boss fight in. You come through the door and you can't see. What are you going to do? Okay, so we have to deal with these every single time we want to get to this boss. Which I'm finding very rude. Oh, they parried me? How dare you? How dare you beat me at my own game? Absolute outrage. I'm going to have to use another flask before I go in there. Yeah, I was quite, uh, quite surprised, but then Wiley said it was made by a different studio, so then I guess that's less surprising, isn't it? If a different studio does something. It's, it's not the same then, is it? Okay, you're fine. Ah! I'm getting so frustrated. I'm getting frustrated because these um, these enemies themselves aren't that difficult, but having to go through them in this way and draw them out and dick around with them every time on the way to a much tougher boss is, is very grindy, you might say. Do they make it hard to see? They do make it quite difficult to see. They're very uncomfortable, and as you can see, the beer cups are kind of cutting into my line of vision a little bit as well, and everything's very yellow. Everything's much more yellow than it should be as well. Oh, sorry. Same studio, but not the same team. Understood. Understood. Okay, so you're about to witness the pain. It probably won't last for long. Um, my new strat here, I'm going to go straight for the stairs, okay? I'm going to dash for the stairs, get the high ground, try and draw the dogs up, take the dogs out. Thanks, Jarrett. Not on me face, at least. And then I'm going to deal with the main boss. There's a little bit of double vision, I feel. I do feel like there's something there with the double vision. Very disorientating. Not this time. Not this time. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay. The dogs block the stairs. The dogs block the stairs. You F boy. Okay, you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're okay. You're actually fine. Get up the stairs. Okay, take the lock off for a minute. Just get a minute. Just take a second. Just take a minute. Does it come up here? It does. It does very slowly, but yes, it does. Okay. Okay, the dogs are dead. Heal. God. The shield does nothing against that very big attack. Now we know. Now we know. Oh, bloody joking. Go! How very dare. Yeah, that's totally true. That's totally true. You're right. You can't, that's, that's what your downfall is with games like this. And I know that as well. I know that that's what I'm doing. You start to get blasé and then you get wrecked by enemies that you should be fine with because you've been blasé. Uh, that's right. But I think it's just the frustration, isn't it? You get frustrated from, from doing the same stuff and then you start making bad choices. Now that's the way. That is what you need to do. I think you need to get all up in it with those. You've got to get all up in it with those. Don't let them get carried away. Because uh, once they get on a little attack streak, it's very difficult to get out of it. Okay, we're doing this thing. We're doing this thing. Okay. Oh my god, is that stairs? There's stairs there. Is there a bonfire? No. Would there be? Would there be a bonfire down here? 
I'm gonna look. You you have to look at this point. My god. Oh, of course there is. Of course there's one behind the uh, behind the alleyway. Of course there is. I have to look. I can't go through the whole thing of there being a bonfire around the corner and I'm taking a long way every way. Can't do that again. We've done that many a time. Okay, so we have a staircase there. We have another long way around the corner. There's something there, but I think it's on the other side of... Uh, what's that? We have a locked door. Can I still loot that even though it's through a grate? A large soul. I have to use these large souls as well. I've got a few of them that I could use. Um, next time I want to do a little level up. What the hell was that? I thought someone farted. It's someone, it's someone loosing off an arrow up there. Damn it, okay. That sounds like a fart, but it's an arrow. Get out of it. Get out of it. Is there more? There's a doorway. This looks familiar. Have I been here? I've been here. Holy crap! Who the hell was that? That was a fart. Maybe I haven't been here. Well, I'm not seeing a bonfire, just quietly. There is some stairs, though. No, that's not stairs. It's a door. Can I get through it? I can. Where does this go? I feel like this is leading to an area that I've been in earlier in the game. Isn't this the beginning? What's that over there? It's a rat. I feel like this is the beginning of the game. It is! It's bloody Firelink Shrine! It's Firelink Shrine! But how far am I from the, um... Well, shit! I don't have to keep doing that bit! Oh, fuck! He's out on the ledge. Oh, if I'm on a swear time, a fucking rip. I don't even care anymore. Die! Okay. Right! Well, this is good! This is good! Now we can just come up here. Oh, well, uh, thank goodness I looked! Imagine if I didn't look! I just decided on a whim that I would look. So I must be learning. I must be learning things. Ah, uh, this is excellent. This is a very good little turn of events here. That's cheered me right up! That's cheered me up no end! Okay! I know! I can't believe it! Everything comes back to the shrine! Doesn't it? Everything. It's all about the shrine. And you know the best bit? Do you know the best bit about this? Is I can go down here and I can eat my souls. I can use the good bonfire. And I'll get ten healing flasks, won't I? Before we go and attempt the boss. Oh, and here's old mate as well. It's all happening. He's here. Oh, hello. Hello there. Meeting you under such compromising circumstances. Ah. At least we both this is good. Unscathed. I'm gonna eat me souls. I am. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna shove them down. See us both in one piece. Get myself all upgraded. I am. Though. I'm very excited. Okay. Oh hello. Terrific and. Okay, that's fine. That was that wasn't very enlightening. I was expecting some words of wisdom to send me on my way. Excellent. Right. What we're gonna do? What we're gonna do? We're going to, um, we're gonna have these souls. I am. I am chuffed right now. Um, I have a large soul of a lost undead. Now, how many do I get? Is that a thousand? Oh, it's only 400. I thought it was more. I thought it was more than that. Um, okay. Then we'll do... Oh, we've got four of these. Don't worry, I'm not going to accidentally eat the butterfly soul. I won't. I'm not going to eat the butterfly soul. I know what you're thinking. I'm going to hold on to it because I might want to use it for a weapon upgrade. I won't eat this one. I won't do it. Um, I can eat the soul of a proud knight, though. So many souls. Look at me go. I've got 8,000 of them now. Oh, this is brilliant. This is heckin' brilliant. 
Uh, I haven't taken on the Hydra yet. I did find it. I went through the Valley of the Drakes and I um, defeated a couple of dragons and then there was a giant dragon, bloody F-boy dragon that pretended to be dead and it wasn't dead and I nearly crapped myself and I ran away. And then I died there and I had to run back and get my souls and run through. Then I found a cave with trolls in it. So I came up from behind and I speared him up the ass and he didn't care so I ran. Um, I'm coming back to that area at another time. I'm not ready for that. Uh, okay, level up. So, okay, all right, now, 6,000, 6,200 souls. I can only do one level. I'm thinking, I'm starting to feel like I might like to increase my resistance. I was talking about that earlier, and the resistance thing is seriously bothering me. I feel so nervous when it happens, and I'd like, I'd like for it to be harder to put a special effect on me. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do resistance. Um, and then we're going to see... We're going to go back and try the boss again. Oh, it's called popping a soul. You just pop it, pop it down your... Pop it in your gob. Pop it in your gob. Okay. So now I've got 11 flasks. Look at me go. 11 flasks. So we're going to take this newly acquired shortcut that I've found. Thank goodness. My gamer sense was tingling when I saw that staircase. Imagine if I didn't look down there. And GG's to chat for not telling me. Because that was probably killing you. Actually eating your soul. Knowing. Thank God I could take these off. Knowing that there was a bonfire there that I wasn't looking at. It's going to bail. I need to take my, take my glasses off. Which I'm keen. Actually, they're um, they're pinching me in the temples a little bit. I'm quite glad to, to have those off, those ones. Okay. Now. We're going to do this. I feel relatively half confident, probably. Now, he's not bothered about me, so we'll leave him there. We'll leave him to it. That's fine. That's okay. Get past Fireboy. Take him out. We're going to be okay. Yeah, I know. It was an, I did hear everyone sighing. You were so relieved. So was I when I realised. When I went, when I went in the alley, I'm like, I know where I am. We're going back to this this bloody shrine again. Okay, I think the rat will leave me alone. We should be fine. Walking past a ladder near the dragon, I know. I didn't know. I know it's hard to believe. But I don't know everything, Philantra. 69% of the time I know everything. I know that, but not all the time. And I didn't know that. But now I do. And now I'm going to check every single staircase and nook and cranny that I come across. Look at this boy. Look at this. Look at him. He's ready. Oh, you can talk to him. I thought he was an enemy. He sounds like Gollum. Why won't you buy some of my moss? Precious. I don't know. I don't think I need to buy any moss. I've got a lot of moss from being in the forest already, but let's look at it anyway. How much does he want for it? 300 souls? That's fucking highway robbery, that. Nah, I got heaps of that. Dung pie? Dung pie. He's got all of the slightly under underhanded items, like the alluring skull. You can put fire on your uh, on your weapons. Okay, we'll bear him in mind. Precious! Dread! How dare you? How dare you insult me just because I didn't buy something? Outrageous. Alright. Take him out. Bye. Uh, then, uh, oh, thank God. I, I am so glad. That is like the best thing I've ever done in my life, I think. Um, finding that staircase. Because I was starting to slowly lose my mind. Having to go through those same bunch of assassins every single time. What happens if you do hit him? Does he turn really nasty? Or can you actually kill him? Like, what's the deal? Oh, you... Parry. God damn it. I should try and parry them, maybe. If there's only one of them, maybe I could. I, let's just try. I'm just going to try and parry this one. Oh, he runs away and then you can't use him anymore. He gets annoyed. Oh, of course you did. Don't use that when I'm trying to parry you. Okay, no. It's a very fast attack. I would need a bit of practice before I can parry that very fast attack. I've got the parry nailed with a few of the enemy types, but that's a new enemy type we've just, uh, we've just come across. Brilliant. 
Okay, we're gonna go. We're gonna do this now. I've got a lot of flasks. We just have to... We just have to get good. Just have to get good. Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's go! Go in. Okay. Fail! You can't see. You can't see a goddamn thing in here. It's ridiculous. Fail. Get back, get back, get back! The dogs are dead. The dogs are dead. Okay. We're fine. No! There's more! I thought I killed them! Why do they keep coming back to life? Are there more? I thought I killed the dogs and they're still alive? Brilliant. Oh yes, everybody, everyone has to let me make my mistakes. It is a real, a proper real first playthrough where I've got no idea what to expect and I have to work everything pretty much out on my own. That is what we're doing here. I'm trying to have a very realistic first playthrough but with people watching. Trying to keep things as much as I can how they would be if I was just playing this on my own for the first time. Okay. I'm trying to conserve my health a bit better than last time. I'd like to keep as many of those flasks up my sleeve as possible. Ah. Got you better than you got me. Okay. Get rid of these. Oh, I didn't get enough time to do the strong attack. I actually hate these dogs. They're a nightmare, aren't they? They're just real pesky. Like, they're not even difficult. They're just really pesky. I don't care for it. Oh, yes, but I'm asking questions rhetorically. They're rhetorical questions. So I, instead of me just sitting here getting sweaty and nobody knowing what I'm thinking, I like to talk you through my process. I like you to know what I'm thinking, what I'm wondering. Um, if I'm asking a real question, um, I'll say my safe word. Okay. It's just for your entertainment, you see. So I'm not sitting here saying nothing. It'd be very boring. Okay. Go, 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 go. Get out of there. The dogs are dead. The dogs are dead. Stay alive. Get out of it. Heal up. All right. Man. Ooh. Fail. Fail. Heal. Oh, you know what I was up to, mate. He knew what I was up to. I'm getting stuck on the tree. This is terrible. Okay. It's all the shit that gets in the way. Like these trees? What were they thinking? Having all of these trees getting in the way when you're doing this fight is the most infuriating experience. Did you see how much health was left on that then? There was this much. I nearly killed it. All right. Well, let's just go. Let's just go before I change my mind. Okay. Fail. Don't go that way. Get out. I'm getting trapped in. That's one. No. This is a heckin' nightmare. Uh, yes, I got this sword when I killed my first Black Knight. I parried... I parried the Black Knight to death. That's why I got it, Wily. Because I parried to death. It was so impressed. The game was so impressed with me for parrying my very first Black Knight to death that it said, here you go, streamer. This is what you get for your excellence. Take this. Take this sword of excellence and wield it wisely. So I did. All right. I got the second one done in the end as well. Second one was a bit of a nightmare. Didn't like that one. 
I didn't parry that one to death. I didn't parry the second one to death. That was that was very difficult. The uh, the attack was totally different and uh, very stressful. I really want to do this. I'm going to be annoyed if I don't because I was so close. I didn't realize how close to it I actually was. So now I'm just annoyed that I didn't get it done. It would be a very nice little piece of progress. Okay. Let's go. Instantly cornered. Instantly pinned! These fucking dogs! It's just outrageous! It's outrageous! I hate those dogs so much. They just literally get in the way. They literally just stand there and go, nah! And you can't even roll out of the way. I hate them. I hate them. I don't even care. I'm not interested in them. Go on your merry way. I'll let you live, dogs. I don't care. Just piss off. Just, yeah, I'll leave the door open behind me when I come in. Off you, pop. Let me deal with the big boy and I'll be on me way. Live your life. You go around infecting people willy-nilly all day. Knock yourself out, you know? I don't know why they're interested in me, though. I don't get it. They need to move on. Right, go. Thrust! Get thrusted, man! Okay. This could be the one. It could be. Usually when I get to the end of my rope, that's when I bring out the greatness. It could be that. It could be my very sinewy um, legs. It could be my very, very sinewy legs. I'm quite glad that I'm wearing these leather pants now, to be honest. Um, I didn't like seeing my legs as much as I was. It was making me uncomfortable. Where's that other dog? Okay, we're here. For the 80th time, we're here. Go around the side. Go around the side. Go around the side. Okay, just go up the stairs. Just take a second. Take a minute, take a second. Get rid of the dog. Bail. Bail off the edge. Bail out of the corner. Have a heal. And roll. There's one dog left. Okay. Get out of there, come on. I'm screwed. God damn it. Ooh. I need to heal again. Can I get a sneaky heal in, do you think? Maybe? Can't see. When you heal, you can't see anything either. It's just so tight. I can't even get a hit in. That's very bad news, that attack. Don't you get tired? Don't you just get fed up? Just leave it be. Leave it be, mate. So you can, you can block that attack, but not the double-handed, not the double-handed attack. No, not that one. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, get out of there. Ah, get out of there! Let's go! Get dead it! 
get deaded. Oh yeah. That is what you do. I am sweating. Whew. Okay. I, I wasn't even looking at the health bar because I could not handle it. When I saw the, the ashes rising, it could be like the happiest moment of my life. Oh my God. Holy shit. Oh, okay. How am I going to sleep tonight now? All right. Okay. I'm overstimulated now. Okay, that's done. That's done. The dopamine is real. Let me look. I can't even remember what was up here. Nothing. There's a door that I can't get through. That's fine. Oh, it's too much. Okay. Let's just keep, let's just not lose our heads here for a second. Um, we've done that. This is all closed off. This is all well and good and fine. That's done. Um, I've got a lot of souls. I've got a key. I got a key, but I couldn't use it for that door. I just wanted to check to see if that was going to do anything, but I don't know where the depth is. I guess it's deep somewhere. <laughs> um, we'll go down here. We've already been through the village 69 times. We don't need to do it again. We don't need to put ourselves through that again. It's completely unnecessary. So we'll make our way back to Firelink Shrine. I am so thrilled. I'm so thrilled. I hated that. That was the most annoying fight so far. And it was purely because of the environment that you were fighting in. Like how very dare they put a boss of that size in a tiny room with a bunch of trees and two rabid dogs as well. Like what are you doing? What are you doing to me? Okay. Wow. Now, I will have, I think it costs me about 7,000 souls at this point to level up. So I reckon, oh, there's a rat there as well. I don't think the rat's not usually that bothered on me though, to be honest. It usually runs away. It doesn't want to borrow me. I'll kill it anyway. That's what you get. That's what you get. Oh, breakfast tacos. That's exciting. I know. It's been a big night. We have made an unbelievable amount of progress tonight. I am very, very happy. Get thrusted. Oh, it was a double thrust. Yeah, don't ruin it. If I just walked off the edge after the double thrust, it would have just really ruined the coolness, you know? Never double thrust and then walk off of an edge. You just lose your edge completely. It's been a very big night, Irk. Very big night. It's been so good. I've been looking forward to it all day. I've been looking forward to this stream all day. And it has not disappointed me. So let's level up. We are going to go for... At this point of the proceedings, I think I might like to increase my vitality. Bring that up just a little bit higher. I'm quite happy with the rest of it for the time being. Uh, now, that resets everyone. Everybody's happy. That's fine. What am I carrying in terms of souls? I feel like I might have more. No, I don't. I ate them all. I ate them all. <laughs> now... I was hungry. Um, hey. Oh, that looked like, actually looked like somebody that was, that I could talk to then. It didn't look very transparent. Um, now I had a plan. I had a plan there in my little head and it was to look at what I've, what I've got in my inventory now. So I've got my moss, I've got some fire bombs, throwing knives, the resin, the skull. I've got one bone. I'm going to keep that moonlight butterfly soul. I don't know what I'm going to use it on yet, but I don't want to use it now. I've got a copper coin. I've got um, some divine ember. Ooh. You know what? Do you reckon, do you reckon I could ascend my weapon? How, how quickly could I get down to old Andre boy? Pretty quickly, actually. Pretty quickly. Because if I go through this little shortcut that I made for myself, um, we'll go in the elevator. Who are all these people now? Why are there so many of them? Where'd they all come from? Hmm? There was only one before. Now there's three of them. Hmm? You look awfully raggedy. You look awfully raggedy. Hey. At least you can do is look sharp. Did I ask? Scare her off for good. 
Who's that? You are undead as well. I am. We've no time to fraternize. I have my mission oh. and you no doubt we must not. They're all very they're all very um very busy. I did. It took me it took me a whole stream arc. I had to go get all the materials. I had to learn electronics. But I got it done. When I when I set my mind to something, I get it done, mate. Don't you worry. So this takes me down up to the church. We're going to dash through the center. Find our way to Andre. I'm going to see if I can do something with this sword. I may not have enough souls though. But I might, I'll get some on the way. It's okay. We'll work it out. It doesn't matter. There's a bonfire there anyway. There's a bonfire there. So I'll just save that bonfire. It's fine. Not too worried about it. It's the sound of getting smushed. They all have a slightly different one, don't they? They're all a little bit different. Different tones. Okay, we go down the stairs. I think. Last time we saw uh last time we saw this magnificent specimen. I did not have any resin, but now I do. Do you think you'll be impressed? Do you think you'll be impressed if I show him my my resin? That was a decaf coffee, Vespid, so probably not. <laughs> there was no caffeine in that coffee. This is just pure, raw dopamine, Vespid. There's no chemical, there's no chemical interference here. You mean no? Okay, that's a rare ember you have there. I've seen one of those before. It's a divine. Oh god damn it! It's for a divine blacksmith. Might you consider oh, he wants me to. He wants to have it. I could produce divine weapons with a flame such as that. So you can give it to him, and then he becomes a divine blacksmith. Oh. Um. Well, he's the only blacksmith that I've come across so far. So I'm guessing that's fine. And then. If I have divine weapons to upgrade, he can he can take care of it for me. Anything, anything for you, Andre. Yeah. How can you say no? All right. Give divine ember. Yes. Well, thanks for that. You've made a fine decision. You soon shall see. All right. Well, that's done. So what about um what if I want to reinforce? I would need uh, how many how many souls would I be talking about here? Uh, I'm pretty happy to stick with this sword that I've got for a while for obvious reasons. So I think it's worth the sultry hammering. Um, Wily. Oh, I need two thousand. Oh, I need some twinkling titanites. Oh, I don't have enough Twinkling Titanite because it's a special sword. I can't do anything with it. But what about my, um... What about if I want to upgrade something that I'm wearing? Like, uh... Something that I'm quite partial to that I've picked up lately. I don't know if it's worth it, to be honest. I don't even know if I can. What have I got? I've got so many weapons! What do you... Like, I... Surely I can sell these at some point. The shields... I'm using, um, I'm alternating between the Grass Crest Shields and the Dragon Crest Shields. I can actually, I might fortify that one, reinforce that one. We'll do that. And I might also reinforce, um, actually I think that's all I can reinforce, to be honest. Or maybe, maybe not. Um, hard leather boots, my helm. I could do the helm. It is. It's bedtime for me in a minute as well. I'm just. I'm just having a look at this before I uh, have a rest at the bonfire. Work, work. Good night, Vesper. What? I me know. busy. Leave me alone. I know. I me know. Me not that kind of orc. I know. I'm going to upgrade my black leather armor, and I'm going to upgrade my fancy pants that I'm wearing as well. Where have they gone? Where's my fancy pants that I've got on? How come they're not coming up? Can't. Oh, there they are. Oh, my boots. We'll do those as well. I've got enough souls, plenty of souls to go around. And also my... My helm. Okay. So we've done some reinforcing. I'm feeling pretty good about that. 
We've given the special ember to Andre. So let's have a rest at this bonfire, and this is where we're going to leave it for tonight. What a good place to leave it after so much progress, though. My god. I can't believe how much we got done. I am, like, when we started, I didn't really know what was going to be coming up, and wow, it has been a time. It's been a time.